Hi Crows fans, I'm Jock O'Connell. And I'm Katrina Gill, and this is the Crows News Update brought to you by RAA. We will bring you up to speed with all the latest at Westlakes ahead of the Crows clash with GWS on Sunday. It could be a slightly different looking Crows side who take on GWS this week with Sean McKernan out with a cracked jaw. And uh, Michael Dowdy's also decided to stay home with his new baby boy Max and uh, wife Sarah. Congrats to those two. Kurt Tippett is also under a bit of an injury cloud. Kurt suffered his second concussion in just three weeks in last week's Balfour showdown. We caught up with Kurt to see how he's faring. They've been two pretty hard weeks really. I'm a bit frustrated by not being able to train and do the things I like to be able to do, but that's part and parcel with it. You can't really mess around when you've got a concussion, you've got to take it easy. It's a bit of a mind game because you're told that you're not going to feel too well in the head and not, not be very clear, I guess, in your thoughts and your mind starts playing little tricks on you whether you're just imagining it or not, but... um. Yeah, look, it's a very serious thing and I didn't feel great coming back the week after as well, so I've learned that for next time as well. You know, I feel like I've come through the worst of it. Uh, early in the week I was a bit slow, but now I'm feeling good. I've been able to do some good training and I'm looking forward to hopefully improving my fitness for this weekend. Oh, well, during the week there's a, there's a series of tests. There's a bit of memory testing, a bit of balance and a few other things. Um, obviously the doc's got lots of questions about how you're feeling. And then later in the week there's a test done on the computer that we've already done a baseline for and that sort of tells us if we're within a couple of percentage of where we should be and right to play. Yeah, you don't want to miss a game unless you absolutely have to, so I'm very keen to play and uh, you know, hopefully I can prove my fitness. Obviously it's a, going to be a good challenge for the team again to go to Sydney and, and win again, so that's what I'm looking forward to. All the best to Tippo, we hope he recovers quickly. Now the Crows will fly out on Saturday morning and they'll also have an open training session at the new Skoda Stadium on Saturday afternoon. It'll be the, f the Crows' first look at the new Skoda Stadium. The Giants were pretty competitive when we played them in round four, so hopefully it's a good match. And don't forget, the Crows' website is the place to go for all your online coverage and player interviews after the match. You can also keep up with the action by following us on Twitter at, at Adelaide underscore FC or by liking us on Facebook. That's all we got time for, guys. Thanks for tuning in. This has been the Crows News Update brought to you by RAA, the insurance you can trust.